Tribe Traffic, Cessna 172, Lima Sierra Papa, entering and rolling runway 17, departing on upwind to Phillip Island, Tyab. <laughs> okay, so it gets noisy, boys. We go to full power on takeoff. Okay. Your window's latched up. Yep. Okay, straighten her up on the arrows. Let's go, full power. Airspeed's alive. Well, temperatures and pressures are in the green. 40, 50, 60, and up we go. A bit more weight on board, it takes a bit more time. Oh my god. Fuck. Oh, oh, oh. oh my god. If you're going to scream, move your microphone away. Sorry. So it's best rate of climb yeah. is uh, when I've got full power and about 80 knots. Wow, this is amazing. Wow. Okay, my first thing at 400 feet is I'm going to turn my landing light off. Five hundred feet. Just going to lower the nose and have a look around. Okay, so Ooh. nobody's ahead of me. Nobody's out to the right. Nobody's out to the left. Keep climbing. Oh, this is so cool. So down below me, actually, I'll just come over here. Oh, wow. And if you look over down here, that's a naval college down there. Okay. So this is actually a naval base. And the Phillip Island Airport is, uh, Phillip Island is in the shape of a dolphin and that's its nose over there, okay? Oh, I see it. Right. Okay, so I'm going to go to COM2 now. So I'm listening in on uh, 1200. Right, we'll on and 9000. Re and all we're going to do is I'll get down to five or 600 feet, just run along this coast to that point up there and then head back. Yep. And that's 600, this is Cows Township. That's 500, so I put a bit of power on. More power means it'll lift the nose. So you can see down there, you probably, you could pick the type of cars, maybe if you knew what somebody who looked really strange looked like, you could pick them out. Yeah, but strange. My mate Mike's house is, um, see the oval here there's a road that runs into the beach yeah you go about five houses along there's a deck with a uh, some stairs a brownie building just here right on our right on our uh, uh, well I can pick it out <laughs> okay when I get down here I'm gonna do a right hand turn and, and climb in the turn when you're climbing in a turn you know how I said the normal turn is this 30 degree mark? A climbing turn's about 15 degrees. It's only because of the aerodynamics and the speed going over the wings uh, that you, if you are if you go to a full bank in a climb, it will tend to keep rolling you further, so you just go to about a half of that bank. And I did a lot of my training around this area um, for practice force landing. Straight ahead, you won't be able to see it from here, but there's a little grass runway, and they just pull the power on you. Oh and then God. go, oh oh no, no, no. No. and then go, what are you going to do? And you go, oh, okay, I think I can land there. So you start manoeuvring. Oh. We're still doing 100 knots, boys. <laughs> oh my God, I shit myself. Holy shit. <laughs> and they just pull the power on you. Oh, that felt horrible. It felt fun. <laughs> um, shit. And out. Like to the right uh, side near the coast over there, you see a lighter patch in the darker green. Yeah. It's got some dams in there. They're sort of um, set out in a square. Uh, and um, you come down here and you do Red Bull racing around them. So you get real bank into it and, you know, back the other way. It's great fun. <gasps> we won't do that. No. No? <laughs> Bloody hell. <laughs> it's that drop that gets me. Had images of a nosedive. I can do one of those if you like. No, please don't. No, 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 no. no. <laughs> oh. Oh. Fucking hell. Just going to do a, a turn, come back onto downwind. Wow. 
Just a normal turn. Type traffic, Cessna 172, Lima Sierra Vapar. Joining mid downwind, a runway uh, 35, type. So I want to come down. Don't worry about it, boys, it's all normal. <laughs> so, can you see the runway? It's parallel to us over there. Yeah. That road there is the end, the far end of the runway. It's it, it's to the left. Right. Okay. Okay. So brakes, undercarriage, mixture, master mags, landing light on, oil temperatures and pressures in the green, and turn. Type traffic. Cessna one seven two Lima Sierra Papa. Turning base. Runway three five. Type. Wow. Seventy knots. Can you see the runway? Yes. I can. I can't. But then I saw one of the flags. What are they called? Wind socks. When I, yeah, when I was over there. Yep. I'm still a bit high. I'm at a thousand feet, so I'm going to come down. Eight hundred. Right, there's bunnings. Seventy knots. See the runway. Type traffic, Cessna 172 Lima Sierra Papa, turning final runway 35 type. Okay. <gasps> Whoa. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Still doing 65 knots. There it is. Yep. Okay, final stage of flap. 500 feet. So that's perfect. That's where I want to be. A little bit of wind coming from the right hand side. Can you see the windsocks, the yellow windsock there? Yeah. So what I'm going to have to do is straighten up the nose and use opposite rudder, normal crosswind technique. So straighten the nose up and a little bit of opposite aileron, sorry. 70 knots. 70. Germany. A little bit finicky this bit. Goodness. <gasps> Ooh. Ooh. We've done it. Nailed it. Amazing. Well done, sir. No worries. You're alive. Yeah. Nicely done. The hardest thing when you're learning how to fly or no. land is not pulling that nose up too early. Because you want to drive it into the ground and then just at the last minute flare it, hold it off the runway, let the speed decay, no power. And let it sink onto the runway. You just panic and um, try to get it on the runway as soon as you can when you're learning. Okay, flaps up. Type traffic, Cessna 172, Lima Sierra Papa is clear of all runways, type.